calls us riffraff from the four quarters. He fears that in confronting the English, we might desert rather than fight fellow Westerners. Anyone could be bought off with a part, including you and you. What then will get us our pay? To demonstrate conclusively that the English will never pardon us. To commit so grievous an action against them that even their priests will not give us absolution. But must it be all 51? You heard me the first time. Meet me at 2100 hours outside the prison barracks along with Southern and Powley. Tell them to come fully armed and acquaint them with our purpose. And don't bring any Indian supports. They don't have the grit for these things. Walter, I went again to the bazaar yesterday. Do you remember the man with two stripes of color on his board? Do you remember how he looked at you and he said you'd come a long way from being a carpenter on board a ship? Anyone touching my hands can tell. They are rough. But he didn't, or look at them. So what, Benedict? The East is full of mumbo jumbo. He's cast our horoscope. Why? He's invaded his city. He wants to know what our future holds. His future won't be much if he begins bothering the men under my command. What did he say? Our stars don't match. Together we are going to come to grief and wreck disaster. The nonsense. That is the kind of rubbish that feed couples who want to get married. As a sailor, I learned to steer by the stars. But as your soldier major, your destiny is in my charge. Meet me outside the prison barracks at 2100 hours. Sir. She may have a point. 
Get out and dance, you whore! 